Welcome to the Shadows Realm. Shadows Realm. Shadows Realm. Shadows Realm. Yeah. Welcome to the. Welcome to the Shadows Realm. <sighs> All right, we're back. I took a couple days off from playing. Um, so, yeah, here we are. Um, if I remember correctly, we just won a ribbon. Uh, Tifa just won a ribbon, which is great. Um, we are going to fly over to... Um, oops, fly. Moss Deep, I believe, is where we went. Yes. I believe that's where the next gym is. We're actually gonna explore Moss Deep first because we didn't really do that when we got there. It was kind of just a get there and go kind of thing. So let's check here. Check the house. What is this? I can explain the game rules if you'd like. What should I describe? Poke jump. Uh, okay, so it's games. I don't feel like doing them. Oh, is that the Scott guy? Brendan, feeling good? I'm doing great. I heard Mossy's gym leader is pretty strong, so I decided to come take a look to see for myself. But there's something wrong about this town. People are going about a warning letter in the Space Center. I don't think it concerns me in any way, though. And then he just leaves. Alright. My little sister exchanges mail with her boyfriend in Fortree. I don't envy her one bit at all. Even though I can't see my friend in Fortree, my Pokemon carries mail back and forth for us. I'm not lonesome, even though we're apart. Oh, good for you, girl. I know what it's like with long-distance relationships. Uh, Space Center. The closest place to space. I'm not gonna go there yet. Uh, let's check this place. Hey there, trainer. A super rod is really super. Oh! Say all you want, but this badly, this baby can catch Pokemon off the sea floor. Oh, what do you think? You want it, don't you? Yes, you bet, you bet. After all, a super rod is really super. It is. Yes. All right, that is great, actually. If there's any water, try dropping in your rod and see what bites. That's amazing. Really needed that. Alright, so there's nothing else up here. Let's go to the other houses. Or try to. Uh, gym. Yep, so this one is the psychic. The mystic combination. Did I already go in here? I feel like I checked one of these houses. Hm, you're loony. It likes Pokeblocks, doesn't it? No, I'm positive of it. It definitely likes pink Pokeblocks. You didn't help me. Guy. Uh, a collection of rare rocks and stones assembled by Steven. Oh, it's Steven's house! My little brother says he likes to go find people's secret bases. Oh, I didn't make one. Alright, so then, uh, let's go into the space center and see what lies ahead. Uh, as for levels, let's see. Tifa is only at a 32, so that's something we're gonna have to work on. So this might turn into that. Before we go take on the gym. Ah, Steven's here. I really don't care about anybody else. Brendan, have you... Have you read that proclamation already? Team Magma is coming after the rocket fuel on this island. I don't know what they need it for, but they can't be allowed to take it. I'll keep an eye on things for a while longer. In the meantime, why don't you go check out the town? I already did that. Did I miss something important, or am I supposed to fight the gym first? Hmm. Are you going to tell me the same thing if I talk to you again? This is an intent to steal notice to the staff of the Space Center. How are you? We are doing fine. We will soon visit you to take your rocket fuel. Please don't try to stop us. We will take the fuel no matter what. Let there be more land. Team Magma. Oh, yep, he's gonna say the same thing. Um, I mean... I already did check out the town. Oh, a ball. Oh, sorry, sir. 
a netball. Um... I mean, am I supposed to do anything else, or am I just supposed to go to the gym? Uh, that means let's go to the Shoal Cave. I guess we can, uh, train in there. Because these level 11s aren't gonna give me a damn thing. When it comes to levels, who else needs some love? Uh, it's really just Tifa, which is good. Okay. Nothing there. Old man here. Are you planning on going deep in there? How about bringing me back some shoal salt and shoal shells? I can make you something good if you bring me the ingredients. Okay. Now Azubat is the first thing I get. I mean, don't get me wrong, I'm glad that I got a Sveal, but... I know I need that Zubat in order to get Rayquaza. At least, well, the way this works in the Nuzlocke. Oh, is there an item up here? Or did I already grab that? Or... This is what happens when you don't play for a couple days. Um, are you water and ice, or are you just ice straight up? Let's find out. <laughs> Super effective, okay. Nope, oh, okay. Oh boy. cut because I'm, I mean, I don't plan on wasting any of the big moves, but if you don't hit them, then I'm going to have to use them. There we go. If I'm not supposed to do this first, I'm going to be pretty upset. Alright, into the cave we go. Well, almost. Uh, maybe if I'm lucky, the bottom of the cave will become a new area, and I can catch a Zubat. <sighs> Just wanted to check if something was up here. That's awkward. Alright, Zell, you just have to hit it once. Thank you. A shoal cave. Yeah, this is all the Shoal Cave, isn't it? I don't think this would be anything else. It just bugged me that it popped up again. Ooh, bulky little guy. Girl.
Yeah, now I'm just paranoid. Because it's like, was that not part of the Shoal Cave? And this is the Shoal Cave? But I thought it was all the Shoal Cave. This is what happens when you don't play a couple days. So I'm going to see if this is a different area. Because I really don't know. And if it is a different area, then I'll actually try to catch something. Because I don't want to catch it and then have to release it. Because that'd just be a waste. Oh my god, just let me go. I went this whole way without running into one Pokemon, and then on the way back I ran into three. Ooh, close. Oh, damn. Same deal as before, you just gotta hit it once. That's all that you needed to do. Okay, yeah, so it is all the Shoal Cave. It just bugged me out. I mean, cool because I'm getting levels, but it's... Well, it's cool because I'm getting XP, but the XP is still trash right now. Shoal Shell. Yeah. Yeah, you really are a bulky little bastard. Which is great. So the only thing that can one-shot you is Thunderbolt. I don't know why I wasted it there. Um, just because it's 30 exact. Oh. Alright, so there is a thing. I just have to get it. Cut still takes you out in one hit, because you're not bull- what? Since when? And you know what, because I just healed Zell, he's gonna hurt himself in confusion. Oh, color me wrong, which I am okay with. Alright, so let's go. Yes. Another shoal shell. Then I need the salt. Oh my god, there's just so many ways to go. I feel like this is going to be the entire episode, guys. Rare candy. There's another shoal shell. There's something up this way. I'm off by one square. Another shoal shell. <laughs> a lot of shoal shells, not a lot of salt. Oh, I wonder if I'm gonna have to dive for the salt. It's possible. I could be doing all this for nothing. <sighs> it's been a while, I can't complain. <sighs> it's just now I'm seeing all these damn Zubats and I'm like, damn it. Like, can there just be a new area in here that'll make me <laughs> be able to catch a Zubat? Like, have a new area, like a, um, a hidden cavern. 
Like, that could be the room name. Hidden Cavern. Yep, I can't lose you that. Come on. How does that happen? Um, wow, I already already used all those cuts. I don't know why it's not getting the one hit anymore. Big pro. I don't know where this goes, so... Could be the entrance. Just from the look of it. Nope, I meant a thunderbolt. Damn it. Headbutt this time. Confirm the kill. Oops, that's down now. And there's nothing here. Did I miss something? No. A level eleven do that in the water? I think some I think all my water areas are just broken. Oh my god. I mean, at least it's level 20. Gave me more XP than the others have. I must have missed something. This isn't right. Like, there's no way. No, well, at least you're about to get a level. It'll take two more battles, but still more experience than the others. Hmm. This is just really weird, unless the that cave wasn't an exit, necessarily. Here's the level. Alright, and if you can get one more Zell, that'd be great. Excuse me. Um, I'm just really confused. Maybe something opens up later? Because I didn't even see a dive spot. I mean, it kind of looks like you can dive on the areas right next to the... Um, right next to the um like the the dark areas right there next to the ledges and maybe that's what you need to do 
Well, there's nothing anywhere. Oh. Yeah, and we're right back to this old man. 4 each. You say you can? You can get those ingredients every day. That's just... It's weird, because those don't really look like dive... Like, you should be able to dive their areas. I don't know, man. That's just really odd. At 125... Hmm. Oh, the terrible training spot. And I still haven't caught anything on Route 125 because all I see are, uh, tentacle. Can I fight you, lady? Yes. How would you like to take on the water-type Pokemon I raised? Sure. I oh, only have one, so you literally meant Pokemon? Oh, a sea- oh, a sea king. Kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it. Don't want to get horn drilled. Oh, boy. I'll take the flail with the crit shit. As long as it dies. Oof. 618. That's XP! And 33. Lost it. Yes! That was fast. And then we have to wait for you to get to your third evolution, which I have no idea how long that'll take. Probably look that up. <laughs> Looks so funny. Love it, though. Let's check your stat boost. Good stat boost. Defense goes way up. Oh, yeah. Let's heal, uh, Zell. Um, let's see. We might have two super potions. Yeah, we don't even need two. A super and a regular. Keep on adventuring this way. Ooh. Hi, guys. Why would a bird keeper like me come out to the sea? Hey, was it you throwing garbage into the sea? It was definitely not me. Alright, they each got two. Presley and Orin. Trobius and a Manetric. Gross. Oh, that Manetric really gotta go then. Come to worst, we flinch it. Okay. Spoot. Alright, uh... Strength on that thing. And fly on the Machamp. Stop. What? <laughs> oh, you're absolutely kidding me right now. You're absolutely shitting me. Oh, my God. Ugh. Oh. 
Um. Oh no, it's... What the hell just happened? My audio went real crazy. Um... 20, it says 26... Okay, it's coming up on 26.30. The video says 26.43. So I, I lost like... 13 seconds of audio. Oh my god. That really just happened, though. Ugh. Oh. Oh, what the hell? My audio keeps bugging out. I may have to stop this and then redo it. Um, yo, that really happened, though. Oh, and it sent out a psychic. Absolutely perfect. Absolutely perfect. Oh, and it's also a flying. <sighs> yeah, great for you, Aerith. You hit 40. Dragon Dance. That's the one that raises attack and speed. Um. Uh. Um, I mean, that's great, but you're only, like, you have two physical attacks, and the rest are special. So it's like, I don't really want to drop Astonish, because that'll come in handy later. Um, Dragon Breath, you need. Uh, Fly, you obviously have to take. Takedown's your only physical attack, so that'd be the benefit to it. Um, I'm really just out of it right now, honestly. That, oh, that one hurt. Mystical step, dance that ups attack and speed. Well, sword dance is the better of it. Uh, or do they do the same thing in this gen? Uh, um. I mean, it is rare that I ever use takedown. Yo, my audio again. What the hell? Be fantastic. Is it going? All right. Wow. Yeah, this is probably just going to be a really short episode, guys, because my audio is funky as all hell. Um, I guess we'll drop takedown. It's not like we really use it ever anyway. Yo, that really happened, though. Okay, I'll tell you why I'm here. I don't care why you're here. Oh, you weren't thr throwing threat. <sighs> Damn it, man. For a big pearl. Oh my god. Second Pokemon I ever caught. Technically, the, the the OG because Poochyana never became anything. Got critted by a Machamp and essentially one shot. Oh, we're gonna have to do some team rebuilding now. 
especially strength and cut. Cause I'm going, I'm going to need those. I know I am. <laughs> let's go back. Um, let's go back to to Moss Deep. Can sell our pearls and then do what we got to do. Nope, because we're going to go <laughs> figure out what we're going to do now. <sighs> right, here are my box of replacements. Fang, you're, you're up to snuff right now, which is good. But I don't know, I, I need, I feel like I really need something, something different. Because you're up to snuff, but you're not, like, your, your moveset isn't really helping. You do have Rock Smash, though, which is great. But I also need something that can take care of my cut and my strength needs. Because I don't know if I'm going to teach anyone else cut or strength that's currently in my party. Uh, though now that I have the, uh, that I have Tifa, I guess I don't really need Riku to have Blizzard. Though Blizzard does hit hard, it's that 70% chance that sucks. Or then again, maybe she doesn't need Double Edge and I can just replace that with, with Strength. Just so she doesn't get the recoil. Because strength is, what, a 70 based? 80 based. So you're only losing 40. It was that Thunderbolt, too, that was also so clutch. So, I mean, if one of you ghosts can learn... Uh, prevent sleep, which is nice. Screech. Night inflicts... Damage identical to the user's level. Curse functions differently for ghosts. Uh, specially cuts the PP at once. Fuck. Uh. Not hit by ground attacks, which is amazing to have. We currently have foresight. It's a foe's heightened evasionist, astonish, an attack that may shock the foe into flinching, which would be good. Because then I don't need it on, um, Aerith. A Sinister Ray that confuses, which is great to have. Inflicts bad damage if used on a foe switching out. So I may pick up Dust Skull. Oh, and that's just going to be more training. Uh, I'm going to have to take your Silk Scarf. Oh my god, this is terrible. Oh, Alright, um... And it's funny too, because I was talking about how Zell's just come in so clutch today, and... Oh boy, um... Well, where do we begin? Um... You were the second Pokemon that I caught in this entire run-through. And, um, no, I lied. You're the third Pokemon that I caught in this entire run-through. And if you told me that I would have had you in my party and wanted to keep you here as a permanent fixture, I would have thought that you were absolutely insane. But the way that you've grown and the way that you have come through for me so many times really showed me that, um... You were, you were well worth keeping around, and, and you pulled your own weight without being asked. Um, it was, it was amazing to have you with us. 
And, um... I know all of the other Pokemon in the party are going to miss you, as I am going to miss you, and not only what you brought to the table, but you as a whole. <sighs> so, with that being said, we say goodbye to Zell, the Lanuni. I, t I still don't even know if I'm saying it right. We say goodbye to an amazing companion and somebody who proved that they were worthy <laughs> to to go the whole way, but unfortunately, uh, divine intervention came and took us away. Zell, it was a pleasure having you on my team. <sighs> Goodbye. Well, with that being done, um, we have a lot to do now, guys. Uh, a lot of a lot of retraining to to go on, and I need to find a good spot to do that. Um, I also have to look at uh strength and cut. I don't think I need to cut as much, but strength is definitely going to end up being a must. Um, I'm pretty sure I'm just going to throw it on Riku. And it'll take over double edge, because I don't seem to use that as much anyway. It's fine. Um, what about cut? Who can learn cut? Thieves and Zidane, and I don't want any of them to sacrifice anything they have, so we're, we're good with this for now. If Fang makes it back into the party, maybe Fang will get cut too, but, um... Yeah. This is where we stand, guys. Um... Just look at everything real quick. Just see it never misses. Uh, that's a 60 base. Which I'm kind of fine with that being a 60 base because I believe Thunderbolt was 8, yeah, 80 based. Then Thunder's 120, but that 70 hit race, uh, hit rate. So who can learn Shockwave, if anyone? No one in the party. So no electrical coverage whatsoever. Fantastic. Um. Jesus Christ. So, like I said, guys, uh, my audio was acting really wonky for some reason when recording. So, I'm just going to cut this session short and then come back at it later. Um, I guess it's a good time, too, considering we just lost an OG. And uh, I think uh, going on would just be really sad. So... With that being said, um, we're sitting here on six badges. Our seventh one is right in front of us, but we just hit a block. Um, granted, it's a psychic gym, and he wouldn't have seen any playtime anyway in this gym. Um, I, I still want everyone to be up to par because I expect perfection, honestly. So, <sighs> this video is going to end here, a little short. Sorry about that, but audio's being wonky. I appreciate you all watching the video, and we'll catch you next time and see how this all goes. Later.